Hello viewers, welcome to another SMC tutorial video. This video will show us how we can create a burner wallet in our software wallet. Let's get right into it. So all you need to do is to tap on the software app and then you tap on this menu icon, okay, at the top left. As you can see, let's say this is your main wallet, right, having $86 and you want to interact with a D app protocol, right, and you're not sure if it has a embedded a malicious link in it or probably is trying to drain your wallet all you need to do is just to create a burner wallet and you do this by tapping on this menu icon at the top left tap on edit and then you tap on add wallet then you tap on create burner wallet give the word burner wallet a name you could just call it anything you want dgen okay and then you tap on create a new wallet will automatically be created for you and then you can tap on this the app this in-app browser here and then you can impute the link that you'd want to interact with the the app link that you want to interact with you're not sure of and then you go ahead with your transaction so if it has any intention on draining your wallet you already know that you're safe your main wallet is safe and this whole burner wallet can just um, be left for it to carry out its activities so once you're done with the burner wallet all you need to do is to just to tap on this menu icon and then you tap on edit and you tap on these three dotted lines and then you can always remove the wallet you no longer have any use for it okay so once you tap on remove wallet it tells you that you can restore this wallet later and the burner addresses are derived from your recovery phrase that can be restored gives you the process of restoring your wallet and please note that your burner wallet can only be restored if you already had a transaction done on the burner wallet okay so if your burner wallet is empty there is nothing to restore it's not going to be restoring your wallet for you so once you tap on confirm the wallet has been removed as you can see so if you tap on edit again and add tap on add wallet you say that this is the process of restoring you can just tap on restore burner wallet so if you had an activity done on the burner wallet it would restore your burner wallet for you however if you do not have any activity done on it it will tell you that you do not have any burners to restore i hope this video has been helpful if you have any questions do make a comment in the comment section and rest assured that someone will be available to attend to you ensure you subscribe to this channel like this video and do share this video because it can help someone to avoid being drained right because we do not enjoy when believers come to tell us that your wallet has been hacked or they didn't know that they would get drained when they interacted with this link so ensure to share this video and it's going to help someone to be able to play safe in the web tree space thank you for watching guys and see you in our next video